So in the last video, we saw how you can set up WhatsApp API at the uh, Facebook platform. And now we will see how we will do the integration with WhatsApp API and TeleCRM so that you can start sending messages and, uh, you know, do WhatsApp campaigns. For that, in the left side of TeleCRM, click on integrations, go to WhatsApp Cloud API. Okay. Click on connect. There you will find an option to add new. I'll click on add new. It's asking me for business ID and access token here, right? A business ID and an access token. For that, I need to go to my this WhatsApp, which I have created for Cloud API here, where I have verified my number and copy this business ID, paste it here. Then again, I'll go back and get the access token from here. I need to copy and paste it there to start this integration. But this will be a temporary access token, which will expire every 23 hour. So every 23 hour, you have to come copy and paste it again. So it's good when you are trying for the first time, it's quick to get started. But in order to do a permanent integration to get a permanent access token, just click on configurations here and see, learn how to create permanent token. Click and this will open up on a platform where you will get the overview of the business API, what you require and all the things you have already done that. Here is the thing that we are looking for, right? This option, the one I'm highlighting. Just click here and an eight step method will open up that will guide you to create the permanent access token. Let's do it. So I'll click on business settings and I have to choose a business. Remember I choose cross marketing and strategies. I'll click here. Then in the left side, see system users i have to click here now i have to click on add choose a username i'll say tele crm and then choose a designation if you have already an admin as a system user you can choose an employee here otherwise choose an admin then click on create system user Once the system user is created as CRM, click on add asset. Then choose this platform, give the access, then go to apps and give the access for your apps as well. Right? So done correct once this is done i have to click on generate new token select an app this one then along with all these permissions we have to find everything that has whatsapp mentioned in it so whatsapp business messaging messaging whatsapp business management Then I guess these two are only here. Yeah. Once that is done, I'll click on generate token. And once clicked, I'll have my token generated. So this is my permanent access token. I just have to copy this link. Go to my tele CRM, paste it here and click on connect. And once you do that, your Vaka integration will be live. And here you can see all the settings. Like, uh, this is your sales number from here. You can decide 
who are the people in your team who will be able to send messages from here and if you turn this on create new lead that means whatever message you receive on this number will be created as a lead this section is your template section wherein you can see all your templates and in the next video we are going to see how and where to create whatsapp templates